Furniture Bank, we're going into our 20th year this year. Uh, it was started by a nun and she was working with refugee families at the time and was discovering that our social support systems ended uh, once you got keys. Back then, she sort of rallied volunteers together to match families who had furniture to families who didn't have furniture. So about five years ago, we were very paper-driven. And today, uh, this last year, we made a very significant investment with the help of Traction to further embed our programs in Salesforce to get significant automation, significant productivity. The technology really helps when you're on the floor with the family because it makes it easy for us to track what the family has selected. It just makes the whole process a lot smoother and a lot less intimidating or daunting for everybody. You know, we talk about KPIs, well, why do we do it? Well, as a charity, we're still a business. As a charity, we're still trying to make our, our world a better place. And we use the KPIs that come out of that Salesforce platform as a way of uh, reviewing and measuring and improving our services and improving our systems so that we can support more families. We've started to receive inbound requests from communities across Canada and the United States to bring our model, including our platform as a service, to those communities. And a lot of the work we started this last year is providing the ability to say yes when Pittsburgh calls, when Vancouver calls, and they say, could you bring this platform, this call center, this dispatching, this marketing platform? We're now in a position to start to be able to say yes and be able to scale that impact. The Furniture Bank does work that I think is just so fundamental to everybody. It provides people with furniture to create their home, to have a place that's safe and know that they'll wake up in the morning and they'll be able to sit down at a breakfast table and share a meal. I think that's what we all long for. When we look at what's the horizon line is we see these brilliant business models around the world and the act of collecting society's unwanted quality furnishings and creating a countrywide system to all citizens that when they need us, we're there and in 72 hours they're in a home. Uh, that's when I know we've reached the, the destination.